You should know your wife better than that. Man, I was doing good till we got to this row, but okay, go ahead. <laughs> are you ready to find out how well my husband knows me? If you are, definitely stick around. What's up, Flourishing fam? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Dolores, and welcome to Flourish with Dolores, where I teach you how to embrace your journey. And remember that flourishing is about progress and not perfection, honey. This is my handsome, my fine husband, Dr. Charles Farmer. We've been together for nine years, over nine years now, nine years, two months. Mm -hmm. We knew that. And oh, I should have <laughs> added not, that. That's not one of the questions. <laughs> Um, we've been together for nine years, two months, and married for like... More than half a year, I know that. Yeah. <laughs> we got married in June, and we're filming this in March. So, like eight months, we have been married. We married, so. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is how well does my husband know me? Um, I pulled these questions, some of them just from the top of my head, a lot of them from the GQ quiz that we've seen, like Sierra and Russell Saweetie, Wilson. Russell Wilson, do So um, we're both going to write our answers on this board, and that way you can see if it's really my answer and not me just making up something from the top of my head. All right, so you ready for the first one? I am ready. All right, first one is when is my birthday? Easy peasy. <laughs> and do the year. Okay, I'm ready? ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Well, it's kind of hard to see. But yes, you got to write April 19th, 9 to 1, baby. Turn it 30. Woohoo! <laughs> so we have 20, <laughs> we have 20 questions. That was just the warm-up. What is my favorite color? I'll give you. I don't need no uh, head. Yeah, okay. You don't need no hint, but you was looking up to think. <laughs> I was looking for God for help. <laughs> okay. One, two, three. Yes, I put white and pink because I've really been feeling white lately. <laughs> but pink, pink is my favorite color. Some people say white isn't a color. White is a color. Clear isn't a color. But white and pink, babe, that's new. Before, <laughs> when I met him, it was lavender and pink. Yeah, but now it's, I, I almost put lavender, but I was like, yeah, I think pink is the new one. That's the old Dolores. The new Dolores is white and pink, but you, mm -hmm. you still get the point. So Charles has two points so far. All Woo! right, one roll, yeah, buddy. What physical feature do I love most about you? <laughs> There's so many, really, so I don't, I don't, you just don't have to, I don't know what I'm gonna put. All right, I must be doing something right there. I mean, I said you're fine. <laughs> All right, ready? Yes. One, two, three. What you got? Hey! Ah! <laughs> yeah, look at you trying to show your smile. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes, baby, I love your smile. I love your height. I love your beard when you keep your beard. You're just so cute. I love your dimples. Actually, that is incorporated in the smile. <laughs> All right, I got three. Where was I born? And you need to put the city. The state. We don't have cities and state, but wow. you're gonna put the country and you're gonna put the location. Okay. Technically, the state. Oh, ready? One, two, three. Did I get it? Yay, you did! Yes! <laughs> that's, that one, that's pretty easy because that's the capital. What? See, don't, don't discredit my. In Accra, Ghana. Don't discredit my Ghana. effort. <laughs> Ghana. All right, good job, baby. Thank you. Four for four. All right. Number five, what are my love language? What's your love language? I got two, so I'm put two. Okay. All right, I'm ready. Uno, dos, tres. Did I get it right? Uh, words of affirmation and acts of service. Ding, 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 ding. Dang, so you know me, know me? Yes, baby. <laughs> of course I know you. We gonna turn it up. We gonna turn it Why? up. Why? <laughs> The people gonna think we cheating, but no, this is this is as real as it gets. This is nine years, baby. This is nine years. And actually, I actually changed my mind a lot. So I didn't put questions in that was like, what's your favorite TV show? Cause it just depends on the day. Favorite music, it just depends on the day. Favorite artist, like I don't really have like favorites. <laughs> so I didn't, I didn't wanna confuse you on that cause I don't even know. All right, how many siblings do I have? <laughs> Uh, 
That looked like a lot. You was counting for days. Oh, sorry, I gotta stop looking before you. Yes, I have eight siblings. <laughs> Got a lot of them, baby. Mm -hmm. I love them all, I love them all. Took me a minute to get them all right, but I got it. <laughs> Shout out to my sibos. Okay, um, six for six. So, what, number seven, what is my favorite ice cream down to the brand? Down to the brand, you gotta spell it right. What, why? Cause it's too easy for you. No, no, I shouldn't. You haven't had this in a while since we gave those sweets for I know. Months. I'm actually kind of not even craving it like I used to. Yep, Hagen dazs caramel cone, baby. It has to be from hot. Like, don't get me just any caramel cone, and don't get me any Hagen dazs Like, it has to be Hagen dazs caramel cone. All right, baby, you so far hundred. <laughs> eight know. for eight. Yeah, don't even All bother. Right. Don't even bother keep a score, yo. Yeah. I'm gonna turn it up. I'm gonna turn it up. Hundred percent. What is my current job title? <laughs> You all right? No. Oh, you was all confident. <laughs> I had to take a second to think. Damn, my title long. I'm tired of writing. One, two, three. <laughs> what did you say? Assistant Director of Graduate Student Engagement. I said Director of Student Engagement at School of Nursing. That's should we give him the point? I think that's really close, considering I was like taking a stab in the dark. That's fairly cool. I basically got the director of student engagement in the school. That's basically it. Give me that. Ah, uh, uh-huh. Yeah. All right. I feel like it should be half a point, but we'll give it to you. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Just remember, just remember when it's my turn. <laughs> mm -hmm. Just remember this moment oh, when it's yeah. my turn. Right. Mm -hmm. um, what is my, what is the, my favorite aspect of my job? Oh boy. He mostly hears the complaints, but. Yeah, I'm like, okay. Um, I know, I gotta stop looking, because then I'm not surprised when you turn it around. All right. One, two, three. Student advising. What'd you say? The students. Like I, I mean, that's the students, it's the students. <laughs> That is true. Yeah. That is true. Yeah, like what, what, what about the students? You like advising? I like, I, what keeps me motivated to do my job is helping the students. Sounds like student you advising know? to me. <laughs> Comment below if that counts. I should go. Okay, what it, okay, what we're gonna do is you get half a point from the last one and a half no, a point. No, no, don't try to discredit my one. <laughs> That's the students. Mine was more specific. I basically I should get, I should get two. No, no. Comment below if you think I should get an extra point for being specific. How about that? <laughs> ah! Okay. So, number 11. What is my dream for Flourish with Dolores? Like the kind of like the end. I got it. Amen. Hey, <laughs> I must have really not got this right. You're writing so much. Supposed to be one dream, right? Not like eight. <laughs> Just the dream is, is you got multiple dreams for something, so it's three. I have wrote down three. You How are you gonna say three and, and not even say it? All right, if you wanna add something, go ahead. No. All right. One, two, three. What did you write? To have multiple endorsements. Is that on any of three? No. What? <laughs> I mean, yes, brand deals, yeah, but it's not like that's not my like end dream. I mean, yes, the brand deals will help pay the bills, but my dream <laughs> for Flourish with Dolores is for it to become a successful coaching business. So I wanna have coaching clients, more coaching clients. Um, I wanna have international marriage retreats, so you know how we do our group date nights. I want us to be like St. Martin's 2021, like, or 2028, whatever year it's gonna be. Um, and work then I wanna work- myself. Yeah, I wanna, <laughs> I wanna work for myself, AKA, one day, quit my job. No offense, yeah, my job. So you can quit when you have multiple endorsements. So therefore, I think that counts at least for number three because that's where that does count for number three. All right, good. So but I, I meant like, what's my dream for? No, we're not giving you a point for that. But that was close. Yeah, that, you, get, you get a kitty kiss. That was the most subjective question. 
There was no clear right answer. Well, you should be listening to when I talk about my dream for it. It changes by the hour. Well, right now, <laughs> right now my goal is multiple endorsements with sponsorship deals, but like it has to work towards a, a greater meaning. Yeah, work oh, for Tar yourself. Charles doing the tapping. Yeah, work for, <laughs> work for myself. My for F A M A. Work for myself. Mm -hmm. Keep the game going. So Charles has ten points. Number twelve. What is my dream professional career? So let's say I didn't work. Let's say I didn't get a chance to work for myself, or before maybe I start working for myself. What would be my dream professional career? You mad? Cause you had you had a different energy earlier. Yeah, then we got to these questions. <laughs> I already know this is wrong, but I don't. I don't you don't care? I don't, have, I don't know. You should know your wife better than that. Man, I was doing good till we got to this row, but okay, go ahead. <laughs> One, two, three. What do you have? University president. I mean, <laughs> here we go. <laughs> You're wrong. So <laughs> I want to be a vice president of student affairs. Um, That's not university dean university of president. Students. So I work in higher ed. The president oversees faculty and student affairs, like administration. Mm -hmm. I don't want to oversee faculty. So I don't want to be president. But a vice president, you know, you have different vice presidents for different things. So you have vice president of finance. You have a vice president of of like fundraising, um, as like advancement, university advancement. I want to be the vice president of the students. Remember, the thing I love about my job is the students. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no point. <laughs> That's like Kamala saying like, yo, I just want to be the vice president. Man, when you take on that role, the chance you can become the president. I'm not limiting myself because that's not my dream. Like, I'm not dreaming to be president. Mm -hmm. I'm not dreaming to run a university. Mm -hmm. I'm dreaming to be president of Flourish with the Lords. I am president of Flourish with the Lords. <laughs> I'm like, never mind. <laughs> All right, so that was number 12. Charles has 10 points. Number 13, you really don't like losing. No. He's getting all uncomfortable. <laughs> Type A personality is here. All right, number 13. What is my most used phrase? I don't even know. So this one, Oh, so what am I supposed to do this? Well, this one you won't get wrong. It's just if you make me laugh. <laughs> if you make me laugh and you're like, yeah, yeah, I say that. This is hard. Maybe this is like a bonus one. Cause I don't even know what I be saying. I know I spelled it wrong. Oh, that my best. So I don't know why I say that. It's like my little Spanish moment. Fun fact: in middle school, I had a bunch of Spanish best friends. Those are my girls. Um, yeah, I like saying to him when I want to kiss. That my best. So that my best. So suavemente besame. Da 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 da. Is that actually how you say it? Huh? Is that how actually how you say it? Besame. No, that my best. Yeah. That okay. is give me beso is kiss. Fun fact, another fun fact. Charles used to do my Spanish homework. Is this like illegal to say? Saying that, <laughs> what's he all gonna do about it now? Charles used to do my Spanish homework. Um, my junior year? Yeah. Yeah, he taught me my Spanish homework, but then he went to medical school and lost all his Spanish, and okay. I know a little bit more Spanish than he does. So the Suavemente <laughs> song is, Suavemente is slowly. Uh, so see. Suavemente, so kiss suavemente. me slowly. Besame. If you can recommend uh, uh, Spanish speaking course for me, some medical, some medical Spanish so I can communicate with my patients better. So, or you can get like a virtual tutor. I mean, you could do um, Rosetta Stone. Rosetta Stone, yeah. Yeah. All right. Did you get that point? Yeah, you can get that point. I don't know what I say a lot, but I do tell you that my best. Okay. So, oh, don't be looking. I'm not looking. Question. I don't need to look. Mm. A number 14, so Charles has 11, 11 points. Um, number 14, what is my pet peeve about you? What I don't like you be doing. Oh, let me see. Which one do I want to pick? <laughs> oh, I, I know, I know, I know. Which one do I want to pick today? I know. Uh, I know. Okay, ready? Yeah. One, two, three. What'd you write? Forget to... Take the water bottle out of the bag. Water bottle out of what bag? My be my backpack. Oh yeah, that's annoying. What did you put? Well, well that's similar, not putting stuff away. <laughs> I put not putting stuff away. So Charles, I packed Charles lunches. 
The man has one job. When you come home, <laughs> take your lunch bag out of your bag, spray your bag, your book bag, like your workbook bag, with disinfectant spray. Bring your lunch bag. This sounds like multiple jobs. You see how it's exhausting, right? You see? <laughs> Charles, so who's supposed to do that? Me? No, I just don't feel like doing it in the moment when I get home from work. What? No. <laughs> so then when I'm trying to make his lunch and I'm looking for his lunch bag, it's still in his dirty book bag and the book bag didn't get sprayed. So all I ask is when you get home, spray down your book bag, bring your lunch bag up, put your water bottle in the sink. That's it. That sounds exhausting. It's something that's often to make your lunch, so guess who's gonna make their own lunches? No! <laughs> Alright, let me get that point. I got it? Yeah, it's a putting stuff away issue for me. <laughs> Alright, number 15. What are three things I never leave the house without? Okay, I'm ready. Uno, dos, tres! Phone, purse, keys. I mean, I need my keys to get in the car. I was almost gonna put keys, but it's actually, it's actually water. Actually, you leave the house with all water, because then that's all we gotta stop somewhere, because you right. You, so the thing is, I need water. <laughs> so what'd you put? Phone, purse, water. Oh. <laughs> you know, what I was really about to put. I was about to put phone, purse, and hair. <laughs> <laughs> I left the house without hair on my head. <laughs> Just slap a uh, slap a hat on. That's funny. Should you get the point? No. Fine. Okay. Number 16. What, so I'm from Ghana, which means we married, so you from Ghana. Well, you're not from Ghana, but you Ghanaian now. Mm -hmm. So when is Ghana's Independence Day? We need a month and we need a day. We could do year. Yeah, year? <laughs> I'm a little iffy on the year myself. No, great. All right. I'm going to take a guess. I think 56. I think 1956. That's when Seahawks found out. Uno, dos, tres. <clears throat> March 6th, Charles put May 18th. Oh, you look so happy. <laughs> I mean, you got the M right. <laughs> oh, You're welcome, baby. <laughs> what are the top two Ghanaian phrases? Not really like a phrase, I'm not saying like the language, but yeah. just like sounds I make that are like Ghanaian. Like for example, like you know how like a black sounds like yo yo yo, uh -huh. you know. So like, yeah. what what are two phrases I would say that's like from Ghana? One, two, three. What's ting? You know, you be like thing, but you like ting. Oh, that's good. <laughs> and shrat, I have shrat too. Shrat is like look, like so you could be like. Shrek, like, look at this. Or you could be like, Shrek, like, you know, look at it. I probably spelled it wrong. But the one that's big is like, A, like, A, A, oh. A, 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 Like, when we dance, A, 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 I don't feel like that's stop, unique stop, to get. Stop, Cause like, when you go to a club, and then, then, then you know, they be like, A, A, A. That's a different A. I oh. was just like, A, 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 A. Y'all was like, A, A, A. Ooh, that's it, y'all. This game is rigged, boy, I tell you. Okay, so who's getting a point? I guess not me. <laughs> you get, well, you can get a point. No, that. I don't need your pity points. <laughs> um, Number 19, so we have 20 questions and then I have a bonus. So number 19, Charles is still 13 points. Mm -hmm. So number 19, if I had a million dollars, what top three things would I spend it on? One, two, three. Uh, flourish with Dolores. What does that mean? Just like the entire brand. You would do just put money. Oh, invest in it. I like that. Vacation house. I like the stuff you put. I have buy our house. So either pay this one off or put it towards like our, our dream home, which I feel like if you pay this one off, then you put it towards that anyway. So mm -hmm. same thing. Pay our loans. Forgot about that. And then I want to start a scholarship fund. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. So I guess, yeah. <laughs> Yours are good though. Yeah. I would do that. Mm -hmm. I would do that. But th this stuff would come first. <laughs> we still got loans, baby. There ain't no vacation time. <laughs> Man, you know they get paid eventually. <laughs> Should you get the point? No. <clears throat> last one, twenty. Yes, last one, twenty. Favorite thing to do? What's my favorite thing to do in past time? Like to pass, like when I'm when I have time to chill. Oh. What is that? <laughs> I know, right? 
When do I get to chill? One, two, three. Listen to The Breakfast Club. I actually do enjoy it at night, like when I'm taking a shower. They crack me up. It's like stress-free, but lay. I know lay? You, I know you're gonna say lay, because I'm always like, I just wanna lay. How is that passing time? I don't understand. That's just like someone saying like, yo, I sleep to pass time. Like, yeah, well, maybe I shouldn't have said pass time, but like in my spare time, what do I wanna do? Sleep? <laughs> I don't, I don't listen to The Breakfast Club in my spare time. I listen to The Breakfast Club like while I'm showering that's or while I'm time. working. That's your spare time. A shower? That's how sad my <laughs> life is? If I have free time, <laughs> if I have free time, I just want to lay. I just want to be still. That is part of your free time. That <laughs> you have time to shower and you're like, oh, I'll go do that and relax and listen to The Breakfast Club. <laughs> so, the bonus question is... Mm -hmm. There's no right or wrong. I just uh, want to know what you think. Sure. Um, what did you not expect about me, but you love about me? Like you didn't, you didn't see it coming, but you like, I like that about her. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize that you um, are very like low key and can be like a homebody yeah. at times. Like that. Like I, I feel like I thought. Initially, me that like you were gonna be like, oh no, yeah, like I want to be out like every weekend and but re but after no one realized that she does not like to do that at all. No. <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't know if there was because when you met me, I was going out a lot, but I think I did it at the right time in my life, like college, like yeah, college. Was college yeah, I was college. turning up, so now that it's out of my system, even before college, high school, I was leaving the house, turning up. I don't know why I'm whispering like my parents can hear me, but <laughs> <laughs> you know you can still get in trouble. It doesn't matter how grown mm -hmm. you are. But I feel like I got all that out of my system so early in life that I don't have the energy. I don't have the time. I don't have the interest. Yeah. We just, we're very low key. Very, yeah. very low key. Like our dream, but right now it's hard to say that because we're in the house, but like pre this whole where the life is right now, like if someone asks us like, what's your dream date? We'd probably be like home chilling, <laughs> home chilling, watching a movie, yeah. you, know? you know? And yeah, that's how we are. But I hope you guys enjoy this. Charles got 13 points. I did throw some, you know, doozies at him. But we are gonna play how well um, I know my husband in the next video. So if you're interested to see who won the game, so right now Charles has 13, you'll see what I get. Definitely tune in to the next video. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you there. Bye. Bye. Peace. And, oh, oh, sugar. Papa,